Well, welcome, everybody. I'm here today with Gabrielle Rutten. She's going to help me with this really interesting set of questions, actually, that we have. Gabrielle is an MD uh, located in Europe, the Netherlands. She's the director of uh, the Gary Craig Official EFT Training Center uh, in the Dutch language. And uh, as you may know, I'm not a doctor. She is. So we've, we've got some interesting topics here that have been written to me. I'm going to read them to you. First of all, Gabrielle, say hello to everybody. Hello, everybody. Okay. <laughs> I love it when, when you make me do that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like in, I'm a very obedient little circus. What is it? Monkey, maybe? <laughs> <laughs> Something like that. Something like that. Yeah. Anyway, I've got this email. I, I, I want to read it. It's, it's a it's a paragraph long, but it talks about lots of different things. But there's an overall theme involved here, which I think our our readers are going to, or our listeners are really going to warm up to it. And that's why we're titling this, Why Am I Getting Nowhere with EFT? I get people writing that. I tried it and I've done this and so on. So let me read this to you, and then we're going to get behind yeah. this, because this is going to be quite useful. It says, Dear Gary, I have been tapping let's just stop there for a minute they've been tapping tapping is an older version of what we've been doing it's not that it's bad or anything but it's just not the unseen therapist okay i have been tapping for some time using online tools and resources i'll stop there a minute. online meaning they're scouring the internet to find everybody else's version of and there's lots of them and they conflict of what eft is so i have been tapping for some time using online tools and resources I feel still low on energy, tired, disappointed in not seeing and feeling a shift, unable to feel clarity. There are days when I feel good and do the work sincerely. Many days I feel like I need to drag myself okay, in trying to heal from hypothyroidism, high blood pressure, deep-seated anger, gaining weight, not able to wear clothes, mild stroke, narcissistic parenting, lack of abundance, and I'm hoping to disengage from the need from perfection and sincerity. And apparently that's all that she needs to do. <laughs> oh, <laughs> is that all? <laughs> now, it's a lot, huh? Let, let, let me. I know you have a lot to say on this, Gabrielle, and I'm going to turn it over to you here in a second here. But one of the things I hear a lot is people will go to the Internet and there's all kinds of people, very enthusiastic, well-meaning people on the Internet who think they have training because they read a book or somebody else's book and, and they saw a video and, and they've been getting some results. And, and so there's a lot of. Not that accurate versions of EFT out there, I'll put it that way, <laughs> okay? Well meant, yes, 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 yes. But these versions tend to address these things in a rather superficial manner. And we've got to get down to cause. So you, I, that's my preamble to all this. You've got some thoughts, please. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, so this is, it's a, it's a pretty long list. And it's a it's a mixed bag. If I I just wrote them down, but feeling tired and low in energy generally is um, points to um, recovering from stress, because then the body will will uh, you will be very low in energy and you'll feel, feel very tired. So then it's you know a little it's a phase after something stressful has happened. We don't know what the stressful thing is because that's how specific you need to become. Otherwise, you're only aiming at symptoms. And that never, never helps. Yeah. Only and, temporarily at best. And what people will tend to do when they're just seeing the internet version of EFT and they're doing tapping instead of unseen therapists, they'll say, even though I feel so tired, that's aiming yes. at the symptom. Okay, we need to aim at the cause yes, what yes. is the specific stress it needs to be customized to you yes, are you yes. having marital problems for example problems at work your, your your kids aren't behaving i mean i mean it could have all kinds of different things it could be bouncing off of unresolved stuff from 
childhood. In fact, he even mentions yes. parenting issues in here and right. so on. So yes. you've got you've got to customize this stuff. Yes. Or you're and just you're just waving your hand at it basically. Exactly, exactly. So tired and low energy is pointing at some stress got resolved and then you get tired. But the high blood pressure, on the other hand, points to active stress. And obviously, the anger issue points at active stress. But you have to identify, so what exactly is making me angry? What specific moment? And like you said, you need to look at, you know, ongoing triggers that are still, you know, keeping you in all these um, stress moments and the old stuff and early childhood stuff. And you need to be really specific. And so anger issues, that is a an emotion, but you still need to to identify in what exact moment, you know, am I triggered into ang uh, in angry feelings? And that's and, where you need to aim your EFT at. And yeah, I and mean, what kind of cause? I mean, you, you may get triggered currently, something at work happens or in the family or something like that. You may get triggered currently, but chances are it's bouncing off of a whole bunch of stuff you never resolved clear back when you were two years old and five years old and, and stuff like that. And until yes. you really get down to, again, cause and customize it, you're only going to get so far. You're going to write me a letter like this, you know, so true. But go ahead, please. And so, um, so the only thing that is uh, rather specific is hypothyroidism because that aims, that indicates, I should say, um, problems related to feelings of not being fast enough not being able to do enough, always, you know, trying to do more or being not satisfied about what you're doing. So that one is a little bit more specific, but again, it's just the symptom. You need to identify the moments where these types of feelings play a role. And it ties in with her need uh, for perfection because that points to your negative core belief, which again, you need to identify in what specific moments is my negative core belief. I'm not good enough. I'm not lovable. I shouldn't be here. I'm not worth it. I'm not heard or seen. You know, that's what we call the negative core belief. So again, perfection is a symptom. Hypothyroidism is a, is a symptom. Anger, obviously, is a symptom. Um, and you need to identify in what exact moment do I feel like this and combine both daily triggers now in the now as well as early childhood stuff so um all in all i'm not surprised that she's not getting anywhere because she's tapping you know on on the on the uh very superfluously on symptoms only yeah so there i mean there's a there's a big difference between reading a book or or seeing a video or something and and getting some basics down and getting some results there's a big difference between that and really getting down to cause uh, uh i want to point the listeners to the fact that you know below this video are are some essential links i mean there's a i have a free ebook on our latest you know the unseen therapist which is goes beyond tapping actually uh this free newsletter some advanced training and so on but all this is available uh, uh, to anybody who really and anybody can do it to anybody who wants to but you know she take you know, gabriel you're talking about specific we like to use the term specific events we often re reduce things down to exact events events that happened in your life where you were ridiculed, you were rejected, you were hit, you were abused, you were whatever, all these things that happen in our childhood that go unresolved and they show up later on in physical issues as well as emotional issues. But please go on. Well, I'm just, uh, I wrote down mild stroke. Now that is too vague to pinpoint what the underlying problem is. If if uh, I would need to know exactly what are the symptoms. If there is, you know, mild paralysis of muscles, that points to uh, situations where you really feel stuck into a situation, either literally stuck, mostly, um, um, more often, it's psychologically stuck. I'm stuck in a bad marriage or, you know, a really awful job or childhood stuff. And again, it's a symptom that you need to, you know, dive under it and go for the specific events 
that play a role in this. Yeah. And the nice thing about going to specific events, and once you, once you get solid at training, this will become a rather easy thing to do, is we can really define something very clearly. And the more specific we can be and bring in unseen therapists instead of tapping, ah, uh, the more specific we can be, the easier it is to knock down. Okay. And so yes. we'll knock this one down, then that one down, then that one down, and another one down, and another one down, and so on. And the more we knock down, the freer you become, the better your energy becomes, the less your anger gets a hold of you, <laughs> and on and on and on and on. It goes really a rather simple concept you know but anyway please go ahead yes well so it's a simple concept but i would like to add to um yes we need to knock down the specific event which means you have to um meditate preferably or use the tapping until there's no reaction left you need to test the specific event until you know you're completely calm and there's no reaction in that moment so you need to test yeah. it that's knocking down for us. Yeah, I, 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 in our, our courses, I teach testing a lot. I'm big on testing because it's really easy um, to do tapping or unseen therapy, any of this, and it, and get a result. You go, wow. Oh. Mm -hmm. um, but we don't know if it's temporary or partial or that kind of thing until a little more time goes on because you want to keep testing you want to rerun it you want to look for other aspects i mean we teach you how, how to do all of this um but it's very easy to get fooled by a temporary result unless you test 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 so i'm forever doing that by the way and we teach that because thoroughness thoroughness is really important to really clean house here and that's what you want to do that's where that's where the freedom comes from exactly so anything more gabrielle no no i think this is this is about it. Yep. All right. Good. Well, I thank I thank you for your for your wisdom and uh, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this. We'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.